Hello dear traders, you're watching the latest financial news on Insta TV with me, Anna Kasatkina. On Tuesday's session, the Australian dollar is rising in value amid the report on the residential property index. During the Pacific session, the Australian dollar grew 0.03% to the level of 0.7133 against its American counterpart. However, at 7 GMT after the release of the statistics from Australia, the Aussie hit an intraday high at the mark of 0.71. Yesterday, the U.S. dollar was gaining ground against all major currencies during quiet trading despite the weak report on U.S. existing home sales. According to the U.S. National Association of Realtors, existing home sales sank by 4.8 percent in August to 5.31 million units, which is a big decline from 5.58 million units in July. Analysts had expected a modest 1.3 percent fall to 5.5 million units. Units. As for the house price index in the capital cities of Australia states, the indicator turned out to be better than expected. It enabled the Australian dollar to strengthen. Australia's house price index came in at 4.7 percent in the second quarter, beating expectations of 2.5 percent growth. The indicator was 1.6 percent in the first quarter. Currency strategists note that the Australian dollar has not reached the bottom yet and its further decline in the final quarter this year is expected to be muted. Nevertheless, on the back of the sharp fall unfolding since mid-2014, any move upwards is considered to be just correction. In case the Australian versus the US dollar pair tries to overcome the main resistance at 0.7535, which has been the lowest level since April 2015, it is likely to be pushed down. This was Daily Financial News on Insta TV. Stay tuned.